You can support this channel by making goldsilver.com your bullion dealer. We have a price match guarantee, free shipping, experts on getting gold and silver in your IRA, global storage options, and an exclusive insiders program. So far, we've been mining gold at about the same rate that we make babies. And so the, the, the natural currency supply has expanded uh, with uh, the population. However, uh, every once in a while, we would discover something like the Klondike or uh, the California Gold Rush or the Comstock Load. And there would be this sudden bump in the uh, money supply, especially in a certain area. Enormous inflation in Dawson, Canada, for instance, or in San Francisco or, or Carson, Nevada. Uh, you would have these enormous inflations when they would make a big discovery. However, most of the, we've been mining gold now for like 5,000 years. And so most of the big discoveries, there haven't been any big discoveries since what? The Comstock load, right? Yeah. So, so the idea is, as Mike says, add on a little bit, that the, that <clears throat> the gold supply does grow at about a 2 to 4% annual rate. And that is what's, and I don't even like to use it, but the word sustainable development. So if you were on like a pure gold standard, for instance, and everybody understood it had value, you would have probably better decision making by the bankers when they would make a loan. And the rate of growth would be commensurate with the rate of growth of the money supply. Yeah. And you would have a general deflation. We wrote about this in my second book, The Silver Manifesto. There's nothing wrong with the general deflation. Actually, you want a gentle general deflation. The reason is you don't need a financial planner from the day you're born. Because you know $1,000 10, 20, 30, 40, or 50 years from now is worth 1000 from the day you were born. And with our productivity increases, because we're all smarter than we think we are, and we're all better than we think we are, is that generally a product will get better over time. Look at the cell phone for a quick example. So that means you get a higher standard of living, so your dollars become more valuable under an honest monetary system, not yeah. less.